Hey guys, it's Sampanna from the Tapi Next. Hi, this is Devashish. And today we want to talk to you guys about the CW TV shows that have just started. All the new seasons of uh, Supergirl, Flash, Legends of Tomorrow, and The Arrow. The yeah, Arrow, yes. So, starting with Supergirl, uh, uh, how do you think the first uh, I mean, was? I mean, I honestly like, uh, I watched Supergirl, and uh, <laughs> yeah, it's becoming pretty good. But um, I really like how like the character development of Kara Zor was slowly going. You know, she was all happy and like all that stuff in the previous seasons. And now she's become more darker and not exactly darker, but uh, she's taking much much more of a serious tone she's towards her character. Because, uh, she is uh, she is she's lost Mon El, her lover, and from uh, Dax uh, from Dax. And there was the full scale yeah. Daxamite invasion she, last season. She, he very missed it. She had to send him away into space and lose him forever. And that kind of has a center on a more serious, uh, more hands down. Like, I don't want this. I don't want this. I just want to do this. Like, very serious. Like, so. Kara Zorel is going through stuff. Yeah. She and needs our support. Uh, and the people around her are also well supportive of her and uh, want to give her space and time. And they want the old Supergirl back, who inspires hope. Not hope a workaholic, yeah. and uh, that is a Supergirl. As for uh, Flash, I guess. Uh, I I I really like this season opener. It was very, well, it was very not centered on Barry, but I, at the same time it was centered on Barry. Mm -hmm. I mean, the team was really working towards uh, mm -hmm. bringing Barry back. Man, I swear, man, I don't like this new couple of episodes of Flash. I'm just trying to be honest over here, guys. Okay. It's bad, man. I mean. Okay, we lost Barry Allen last season. Yeah, we, the whole thing was, oh my god, Barry, you're gonna go. And he's back in the first episode. What? What was, what was that about? Like, they couldn't build Wally West's character better. I'm sorry I'm going on a rant, but the thing is, and now what would we have? A knockoff version of Brunic Thinker? I know that Thinker yes. is, a, is a, one of one of the major characters in the comics, but I mean, he kind of looked like Brainiac from the Justice. True, I did, I did think he looked like Brainiac, but. Uh, and but, but, the, uh, but the curious thing is how he has an interest in Barry and uh, how he has, a, you know, he has some, looks like he has some sort of a plan. Okay, but why wouldn't you have an interest in Barry? The guy, if you're a super villain, if you want to do something very bad, why wouldn't you take a guy, capture a guy who runs at the speed of, faster than the speed of time, <laughs> capture him, harness his power, then use him as a battery most probably to do something bad, bad you know? True that. I don't know, I think he's just gonna probably use Barry and... Uh, I know, cycling the speed yes, force. Again. I mean, apparently everybody wants to cycle the speed force. Everyone loves the speed force. Barry created so, it. He didn't even know he created it. Mm -hmm. so, so, so hopefully uh, that is a thing for the Flash. The Flash and as the for Flash Arrow. 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 Yes, Arrow is pretty. Uh, I mean, it was, it was <sighs> all right in my I mean, opinion. Arrow. My name is I mean, Oliver. The <laughs> The previous season mm -hmm. was pretty good, so I think it's because of the uh, success and the really powerful episodes that the previous seasons had. Yeah, yeah. I think because of that, it felt a little weaker to me, to be honest. So I, I mean, maybe okay. I like Arrow. I love the fact. The reason why I like Arrow is because um, not I don't have anything against meta humans. I, I love the Flash, everyone, but like you can really see the struggles that Oliver Queen goes through. Like it's like you know your past is gonna catch up to you. This guy's past literally comes to haunt him, kill him, kill his family, everyone, and everything around him. And you know an arrow, an arrow episode is not an arrow episode if the end is not gonna be sad. It's not an arrow episode. It's not. You know Oliver's all happy and stuff. You know it's like you know the, the happy black for just a scene. Then yeah. If, if, if then, then there's gonna be a couple of scenes where everything is gonna fall. No man, it's like see, he worked all his whole his whole way towards this one goal for that one episode, right? Mm -hmm. And then he's so happy. Hey Diggle, how's it going? You know, he's all happy and everything. And then at the end you see like 38 minutes he's happy, 40 minutes you see some other prelude for the next episode that's totally going to make him feel horrible about himself. <laughs> like, <laughs> like 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 how the island blew up, you know? He finally got the bad guy. Yeah man, I'm gonna follow him. He didn't chase his face to the ground, but you know what? Guess what happened? Everybody did. Everybody did. <laughs> Sort of but he is in a coma right yeah, now. Actually, he's, it's, uh, he's in a spoiler. coma, and uh, I think uh, Merlin is dead. 
I don't know why Merlin is, you know, they, they said he's dead, but then actually the contract for the actor is Brianna, so he didn't have any Ooh. future roles uh, as of now, but he might renew his contract even later, so I mean, and plus he's a magician, right, so he disappears, even if they write him off script, it can be like, he'll appear one day, oh, I'm a magician, I can just disappear to come on script, haha. Okay, that leaves us with Legends of Tomorrow. No, that leaves us with Deathstroke, the four Legends of Tomorrow, Manu yes. Bennett reprising his role as Deathstroke, and he might, uh, and um, yeah, rumors have it that uh, there might be a single, um, that, a single solo shot for that, uh, for Deathstroke. So I think that's gonna be pretty amazing how he's going to go and re retrieve his son. Interesting fact about Deathstroke: his family is very interesting as well. If you read the comic books, Jericho is his son most probably. So yeah, and his daughter, and his daughter is also really amazing. She's a killer assassin like him. Makes legend. She makes that proud. Mm -hmm. Now that leaves us with legends. With legends, oh. Um. Cecil, um, Legends I really like Lessons Les of Tomorrow, but for some reason, I, I'm i not liking the way they're handling so This is kind of like Doctor Who, isn't it? No, no, no Doctor is going to be a different thing. But the way the Legends are supposed to operate, I mean, they've went through a lot of things, they've done a lot of things. They're supposed to learn from those kind of mistakes, the things that they've done. But at the start of the show, they're making really new mistakes. I don't know why. Yeah, and they're supposed to be the legends. Yes, and it's it's gotten a very monotonous tone to it. Yeah, like no, no, more like a comedy tone, which I don't really. Yeah, like. yeah. I mean, the kind of comedy is coming from the serious part, serious characters such as Sarah Lance. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. And like those kind, of, there's comedy coming from her, which is no, she's supposed to be the captain. She's supposed to be the badass, and that's. That's, I mean, that, that's what I expect from a not some comedy comedian one liners. I mean, what we must actually take into consideration is the fact that the DC landscape in Legends of Tomorrow plays the most pivotal role in all other television shows. True, it's because they're the ones who are messing around with time. If you, if you, if you notice a couple of seasons ago, the, the Flash yeah. ran back and then he made uh, John Diggle's da daughter into a son, you know. Mm -hmm. A little bit of things like that, you know. So they have a lot of power, but the fact is, like, they're like you said, they make a lot of newbie mistakes, you know. And I mean, like, how can they do but that? Hopefully, they're going to. But they do pull through when they you need them yeah, to pull that, through. That but that's after totally ruining half the time. <laughs> but hey, you gotta make the TV show run, right? Yeah. So hopefully, yeah. Lens uh, picks things up. Uh, so does Arrow. Uh, happy with Supergirl for now, and uh, Flash some extent but i want to see who the villain is in dc legends of tomorrow because the last yes. episode they were like who, who could be worse than an immortal right. tyrant and who could be worse than an evil speedster and you know something worse than the, both of them is going to come out and then ray palmer is going to be like oh wow we're stuck in some other time he's just going to be amazed and he's going to stare at like nothing you know? anyways yeah so that's sorry about the rant yeah so that is what we think and uh let us if you like this video Please like it and comment us on what do you think about the video or what we talked about or the CW TV shows in general or uh, let us know what kind of videos you want to make and uh, yes please like subscribe to our YouTube channel like us on Facebook and this is powered by uh, My City Pulse yes our and location uh, app uh, that gives you all the events and promotions happening in Kathmandu. So do like and subscribe and download the app for um, exclusive Otaku Next uh, offers and deals as well. Yep. And until then, bye, bye guys. guys.